What's going on, Sumolings? Thank you so much for joining us for another product walkthrough webinar. I am Lindsay, and today we are joined by the team over at LiveApp. LiveApp allows you to embed content in your video and broadcast it live via a mobile app. Before we dive in, uh, I just want to tell y'all a few quick things. The first is that if you want to tell us a little bit about your use case, why you're interested in the tool, you can go ahead and do that over in the chat room. The second thing is if you have any questions about the tool, the deal, how to get set up, you can go ahead and leave those questions in the Q&A box down below this video, and we will circle back to those at the end of the walkthrough. And the last thing is that there will be a replay of this available. So if y'all uh, need to step out, you totally can. Uh, if you want to watch this again, you could do that as well. Hello to the people watching the replay. Um, hello, good morning. If you want to tell us in the chat room where you're calling in from, we love to hear it. Uh, that's all for me though. Um, how are you doing, Clement? Fine, thank you. Hi, everybody. I'm excited to have y'all here today. I'm going to go ahead and pass this over to you. Um, go ahead and let me know when you're ready to take some questions. Should I start with the presentation, Lindsay? Yeah, or, go for it. Yeah, okay. So I'm going to start to share my screen. Um, the first thing we are going to do is go through the live ad platform because that's what you're going to do first when you're going to be a user of live app. Uh, so right now you should be seeing my screen, right? Okay. Vincent, can you confirm please that you... Yep, we can see okay, it. Cool. Looks good. Okay, so this is where you're arriving when you subscribe to, to live app. And this is where you drag and drop your PDF presentation that you're going to retrieve on the application. So you just drag and drop the, the PDF. Um, there is no limit of slide. And you'll see on the application how you can go through the slide if you want to show it, to display it on the, your live video or not. Uh, it's pretty, pretty easy to, you to do it. So we'll see it too, like later on, on, the, on the application. Uh, then this is the, the, the space where you're dragging and dropping the logos. It's going to be displayed here on the bottom right of the screen. You can put uh, five logo maximum. And uh, uh, then this is uh, the third part where you can put full screen. Uh, most of our people are um, uh, customizing slide. So full screen slide to uh, say uh, the stream is going to start soon or uh, I don't know to put some advertisements between uh, two, two speeches or between two, two events. So this is all you need to know with the platform. Then I'm going to switch on the application. Uh, let me switch to my phone. It's charging now. It's lagging now. <laughs> okay. Um, waiting for them to enter the. Okay. No, it's not lagging anymore. Okay, uh, Lindsay, can you confirm that uh, you can see my phone screen? Right now I can just see uh, that you've started sharing the screen, but I'm not seeing the screen itself. Maybe it just needs a second because this is what happened while we were trying this out. Okay. Yep, there it goes. It's okay, here. Cool. Okay, so this is the, the, main, the main screen, the home, the home screen of uh, the application. Uh, this is where you arrive once you logged uh, into your account. It's the same login and same password on, on both the platform, the web platform and the application. Um, so you have three possibility. Uh, the first one is to go live um, on Facebook, YouTube, or any other website through RTMP uh, protocol. Uh, you just need a URL um, uh, uh, 
RTMP key to, to go live through this, um, this protocol. But let's go back to the main menu. Then uh, you, can go la you can go offline using the local mode. Uh, it's pretty useful when you want to, I don't know, rehearse or um, save a video on your phone because you don't have enough data connection. So you can post it later on on social media with all the, the overlays and stuff. And then the remote feature, it's when you put the phone uh, basically on the tripod to record and broadcast someone and you don't want to be behind the, 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 the phone and interact from a distance with the, all the inlay. Um, on the tab bar, you have uh, the mini clip you've um, saved before. Uh, I will explain how to save mini clip later on. Uh, then the premium, you don't have to bother about it because you will have the lifetime deal on AppSumo. And then the profile, you can retrieve all your information profile here. Uh, so let's go through a live broadcast. Um, I'm going to choose Facebook. And then it shows all the Facebook page I'm managing. So if it doesn't show any page, uh, there are two possibilities. It's either you don't have any page uh, you are not editor or administrator of a page or uh, live app didn't retrieve the page and you have to go under the, um, the, the settings and accept that live app can communicate with Facebook. So I'm going to take the test page, go next. Here you can uh, enter all the name of the speaker. They're going to be displayed on the bottom left uh, of the screen. So I'm going to put Florian. Reiner is answering the question. I'm going to put it as uh, the CTO. Then Lindsay. Uh, I don't know if I misspelled it. I don't think so. Uh, and then. <laughs> and then what's your job position, Lindsay? I'm a product owner. Boom. You've been promoted to product owner of Live App. Congratulations. And, <laughs> And then I'm going to do next. Here it's to record the live on your phone uh, at the same time you're going live on Facebook or YouTube. So if you have any enough data storage, uh, you will be able to record it uh, without the usual glitch or little bug you can have uh, on the live streaming, the good quality. Then, it's showing a short connection test. Uh, because I have a good 4G here, I can go live uh, in HD. Then I go next, and this screen is preparing all the video, all the inlay that you previously drag and drop on the platform, uh, the stuff we did before, like 10 minutes ago. And then the studio is ready to record. And uh, now you can see my apartment. Um, and I have everything in the studio, um, the slide, the name of the speaker, I can inlay it. And if you want to see what you're currently broadcasting, you go on camera and you have um, an overview of what you're currently broadcasting. To go live, you just have to click on start live and few seconds, charging the live, waiting for Facebook to answer and boom, when you have the red dots on the left top of the screen, it means that you're live. So I can mute the slide if I don't want to, to show any slide. I can mute the name of the speaker if I don't want to put the name of the speaker. And I can also mute the sound, which is pretty useful on Facebook, for example, and you have music in the background. Uh, sometimes the bot of Facebook can shut down your live. So it can be useful when you hear some music and you're not speaking. Uh, I advise you to click on the mute button. Uh, then you have the usual, uh, sorry for, I need to, uh, to clean up a bit my apartment. There is stuff on the, everywhere on the table. Uh, anyway, so uh, this is a screen to zoom in, to put the full screen. Boom. And this is the front camera if need be. 
And right now you can see my face speaking. Uh, once, you've, once you're done with the, oh, one thing I didn't tell you, uh, it's about the slide. You can obviously change the slide and, from, and go through all your, your PDF. Uh, so this is the third one, the fourth one. And going through the PDF like this by clicking on the arrow and going back, hiding the slide. And you can also capture the best moment of your conference or your live streaming by clicking on the mini clip section. Once you've clicked it, uh, it's going to record the 30 seconds before the clip and the 30 seconds after the clip. So right now I save a video on my phone and once I'm done, I just click on stop live. Yes, I'm sure. And it's preparing the mini clip and the, the entire live I, uh, I just saved. Uh, I can go and see the mini clip. It's here and this is the... For Facebook transfer and boom, when you have the red... Okay, this is uh, the presentation I just did on the mini clip. And you basically know all the current feature of uh, products. Uh, I can shut down the, the screen sharing. And uh, I'm more than happy to answer your question if you have any, any request or stuff you didn't get from my French English presentation. Definitely. Sumo links, if you have any questions that you would like answered, you can go ahead and send those in now. We do have a couple questions here in uh, the Q&A bit. Uh, does this work on iPads? Yes, it works on, on both tablets, Android or, or iOS tablets. Awesome. Um, the, and then... The, sorry. Yeah. The UI or UX uh, is just better on mobile phone. Uh, but it works well also on tablets. Love it. Um, the question that we get most often from Sumo Lings is obviously about roadmaps. I'm sure you've been asked a thousand times about what features are coming up. I want to know what you're most excited about on the roadmap. Uh, right now, we want to improve the way inlay are displayed on the, on the live. So we want to put more animation um, because the, the thing we're working on right now is the quality of the live. So uh, we want to, we want to uh, bring professional broadcasts to everybody with a phone. So uh, if you're using a complicated software with a computer like Wirecast, for example, you can put animated content. And this is what we're working on right now. Um, the other thing is we, we're working on is the... Um, other platform destination like LinkedIn or um, any other platform like Telemotion or Vimeo. So we're working on it. Uh, stuff that we won't be able to do on the short term because I've seen a lot of questions about this is the multi-angle, multi-camera. So link uh, two or three phone together to have multi-angle. Um, I, we, I don't think we will, we will be able to do it in the short term. Uh, so I don't want to, to promise things that we, we cannot do right now because we, we are a small team. And uh, another question I had is, uh, do you think you will release a computer version of your mobile application? And just the answer, that question. Yeah, sorry. <laughs> But we just got the question, are you planning okay. to implement a full web platform as well? Okay. Um, the, the answer is no, because the main point of live app is to get rid of computer and go live only with mobile. So we are focusing on the mobile experience right now. And uh, maybe later on, we will be able to connect, I don't know, a camera or go with the front camera of the computer but uh, not before 2021. So right now we're working on the mobile app. Wonderful. And you answered somehow all of the questions that we had here uh, in that one answer. So Sumo Links, if you have any more questions, you can go ahead and send those in now. Um, I, have you gotten any questions on the deal page pretty frequently that you'd like to answer as well? Um, <laughs> let me go. 
back to the LIVAC page. Um, yeah, no, the, the, the most common question were about the roadmap and the, um, I think I didn't uh, say about the roadmap is that we're going to implement the 1080p also. Uh, right now, the application can go uh, the highest in 720p because this is the, um, the limit of Facebook. Um, but we're working on the, the 1080p because YouTube uh, allow live streamer to, to go to this quality. So we're going to, to, to release the 1080p. And the two other things from the roadmap, I already said it's the integrated, the integrated platform destination and, and the, the, in the dynamic of inlay, inlays. Wonderful. Uh, it looks like people on the deal page are calling this easy and intuitive, um, great quality. We got a couple, uh, we had a couple more questions. Is there going to be a whiteboard kind of feature? Um, I'm not sure I get this question. Can you try to explain it? Because uh... my, my guess of whiteboard, like where somebody can write something on the spot. Uh, I'm unsure how they want to implement it in this. If you would like to follow up and let us know. Um, do you need another person to use this or can you use it by yourself? No, you can use it by yourself. This is uh, actually uh, the use of most of, your, of our user. They, they record themselves with the, the front camera and they go through the, their presentation, their slide uh, by tapping on the screen and going through so the easy. presentation. So easy, it's so easy. Um, all right, they wanna be able to like doodle on the screen that viewers can see that live. That's the whiteboard follow-up. Uh, sorry, say that again, please. So for the whiteboard follow-up, is there going to be a whiteboard feature like where you can doodle on the screen and viewers can see that live? Um, we, we didn't even think about it. So it, it's actually a good Great. idea, but uh, it's not on the roadmap yet. yet. Cool. Um, <laughs> If Sumolings want to get in touch with y'all about whether the support questions or uh, feedback that they have, where is the best place for them to get in touch with you? Um, on the chat that uh, is on the mobile app or in our website or on the App Sumo deal page, we are trying to reply very fastly. Uh, just please keep in mind that we are based in France and um, in Toulouse, South of France. So we, we are in a different time zone. And uh, I, can, I can sleep uh, five or six hours, but sometimes I'm sleeping actually. So I talk. want you to get eight hours of sleep every night, like every adult should. That's my hope for you and for everybody <laughs> watching this. Um, but I know that Sumo Lings have questions and, uh, and feedback that they want to get to you. So. I appreciate you being attentive. Please also get sleep while you're at it. <laughs> um, all right, those are all of the questions that we have here. Um, oh, nope, we got another one. Do you have any examples of a live that have been recorded using this? Uh, yes, um, I'm just thinking, uh, how can I display it? Uh, we've been doing uh, the press conference of uh, the Toulouse Football Club, uh, prof professional soccer club here in Toulouse. Uh, I don't know. I, I, I will publish it on, in our Facebook page, so cool. you will be able to, to watch it. Wonderful. Thank you. Yeah, I have no idea how to get that on here either, but... Um, all right, I'm going to go ahead and wrap this up. Uh, Sumo Lings, if you have not already, <laughs> I have a new kitten and she just fell off the couch. Um, Sumo Lings, if you have not already, you can go to AppSumo right now uh, to redeem your code for Live App. It's starting at $59 for a lifetime deal. And of course, it is backed by AppSumo's 60 day guarantee. So you can go ahead and get set up, play around with it, and see how it works for you. Uh, we do love to read your feedback. So if you have any, go ahead and leave those reviews on the deal page. And as well, uh, you can leave your questions there. Uh, and like we talked about earlier, there are other means of support as well. Uh, thank you so much for joining us today and for walking us through this. All right, thank you. Have a good one. <laughs>